For those of you who might be joining us for the very first time and you really don't know what QVC and a Today Special Value means, let me take just a moment. It is something that we've worked on for probably at least a year, if not longer in this case. We present it one day, it gets introduced at midnight. We sh hold on to that price. We give it that red box price, which in this case is $29.98 for the day. The free shipping and handling, all of our live plants have free shipping and handling, and we'll, we will ship these when it is appropriate for them to go in the ground. That means do not panic no matter where you live. We have done this for years. We have figured it out. When it comes to your door in your zip code, that's when you put it in the ground. You don't have to care for it before then. We know what we're doing. I promise you on that. Free shipping and handling. This does have auto delivery because this Sun Patient Collection is the largest we've ever done. You're going to get, depending on what variety, this is the Monet variety, I'll call it, your Pink Maltese. So you are going to get two of the Pink Multi, very popular, two of the new Pretty Pink two plants in the orchid and two in the new purple candy. Look at that one. Do you see how thick and how many buds and how amazing? Talk to me around Labor Day when this plant is this size and tell me you bought it for $5. These are $5 a piece at a today special value price. If you lock into the auto delivery and you have to do it today, we will guarantee you this same set next year at the same price. And it will be delivered again when it's appropriate in your neck of the woods. The other opportunity you have, and many of you are doing more than one, is you're going to get two of these huge white, two huge white sun patients. Next to that, you are going to get um, the new tropical rose, and it's a beautiful deep rose color. This is the one with the variegated leaves. More sun you get, the more defined the yellow stripe will be. And brand new is the salmon color here. And even if you take a look right here, look how many blooms this is going to get. Because we've always loved Philip Watson's Sun patients. He was the first to bring them to the queue, and over the years, they keep getting better and better because of genetics. So they're stronger, they're more heat tolerant, they're most reliable. And once you plant them, all you have to do is water them and just enjoy them. And we'll show you the stages of growth. Before I introduce Philip, I'm going to ask if you have these because so many have been sold throughout the years. Call us, share. The gardeners, we like to share. I want to hear from you. Philip wants to hear from you. Tell us about your sun patient experience and know that the comp retail on this, if you could even find sun patients that would be close to this, would be $66. You are getting six plants, six plants for $5 a plant and they're going to be shipped at the appropriate time. All right, Philip Watson, let me tell you about him. Philip Watson is a horticulturist and a landscape designer. He's so good, he wins massive awards, deservingly so. He has designed gardens in some of the most incredible estates up and down the East Coast and continues to do that. His own garden has been <laughs> featured. Uh, I'll never forget when you brought, he's like, <laughs> and I won't say the name of the magazine because we didn't clear it, but he brings this magazine that you find if you're waiting at the dentist office, that one that <laughs> is expensive, the magazine and everything in it is expensive. And there is Philip, his garden when you lived in Atlanta before you even moved yeah. here. And you use this in your own garden, you use this in your clients' gardens, and I you do. brought it to QVC for years. So congratulations Thank you. on your first today's special value. Thank you. It's Great to be on with yes. you, Pat. Oh, thank and you. and so I sweet, love the way Philip. you described all these because these were a game changer as far as my designs uh, were concerned because it was the biggest color I could get out of an annual. And when, in the middle of the season, when they're nice and big and all this, people come to my house and they'll say, mm -hmm. how do you get your azalea bushes to bloom all summer? Because that is what they look like, but gorgeous colors. And let me just pull one of these out because we're looking at that. That's a beautiful orchid color right there. And that is in the um, beautiful pink collection, which is one of your choices. But this is the size. You see, this when is it where comes. it ships when it comes to you. So it's nicely, nice and heavily branched. Can but we 
Look, yeah. this, follow him down. this is one plant. This is what yours can look like. This is what they do. Um, you're gonna get two each of three different varieties and then you've got your choices of the different collections. But count on these to work. If all you know how to do is water and you've got a sunny location, you can have great success and it'll be more color you can imagine. That's why we put this on auto delivery because of anything I've ever offered as an annual, more people want this again. Want it again and again yes. and again and again. Yes. Here, wait, before you do that, can we just go and look how, this is not the sun patient that impatient that I buy. I Correct. think we're, I think a lot of us are very familiar, myself included, before you came here, with impatience. So impatience are sort of leggy and they sure as heck have never gotten that big in my yard. <laughs> um, look how strong the stems are on here. This is genetics. This is working with Correct. a horticulturist like Philip, who has dedicated his life and his education to taking something that we have loved over the years and making it that much better. Yes, Mississippi State, mm -hmm. by the way. Mississippi State. I got the first Distinguished Fellow Award for Horticulture from and Mississippi well State. And well-deserved. Congratulations. Thank you, but I love these and you will too. Now again, this is our pink collection. You're gonna get, look at this. You get this, the beautiful purple look at candy. This. Brand you get, new, We've nev you've never brought us this one. And the orchid right here, which is the mm -hmm. lighter color that makes everything else pop. And then you got back here, look at this, pretty yeah. in pink. Now, if you've got a limited space, what I've done up here is I planted the remaining three together as a kaleidoscope of color in the same pot. So you got three, four, five, six. That's there, one collection, that's, that's, one order of the today's special value. And, and within that collection, mm -hmm. you've got three matched pairs. If you want Perfect. a pair for the front door, a pair mm -hmm. for the back door, a pair for either side of the garage. Nice. Now, okay. along over here, here we've I'll got our sides. tropical collection here and this is the one with the variegated foliage and let me just point yeah. out is yeah. that in the greenhouses we cannot have enough sun yes there we go to, to make it have the perfect variegated foliage but I want to show you this is what's shipping out to you look at the leaf all three of the ones in the tropical collection have got this leaf the more sun they get the brighter that yellow is now you get the salmon which for me, I mix these collections together. Okay. This sets everything else on fire. This is the catalyst color in your garden. This is what How the designers are always looking for, the, the diving board. So you get two of these in the collection. Okay. Then this is the lightning, pink lightning, which they now call rose. I introduced <laughs> it as pink lightning, but it's got this same foliage. Look at this Imagine foliage with this. Imagine that foliage with in that this, color. In the bright sun, this will have this bright foliage. You get two of these, and then the largest one of all in the collection is this big white one right here with the same lightning struck foliage. This is the end of the season. Keep in mind, this is one plant. This becomes this. And you talked about how on the smaller plant, how dense it is. Look down in there, nothing but yeah. stems, You buds. can't even see it. And so you see all your possibilities. And these are the dreams that come true right here <laughs> <laughs> now talk to us and here yes. i should let everybody know that thirty thousand have already been ordered and many of you are getting one of each set or multiples so that you really can you know five dollars a plant yes yes I imagine that that's what these that's what these get and i love these all you need to do is water and fertilize, and I'm gonna show you how to do it. I mean, these are your gardens, Philip. That's, that's beside my driveway. That's a that's hot area of the garden. beside your driveway? So each clump you see uh -huh. is one plant. And, and, and you live in Pennsylvania. I live so, in Pennsylvania. So these work from, from Maine to Miami. There is a beautiful brand new purple candy, which has got the fuchsia outer petals and that nice ruby red star in the center. And then look at these lighter colors. I tried this collection out. I picked mm -hmm. them out. Okay. And then I tried them at Susan Graver's house because <laughs> I wanted to see how they worked. Look. They look they work amazing. They pretty nice. Yes. And I'm not going to mess it up for Susan because uh -huh. she's too nice to say anything other than, oh, I really like it. But she really did yeah, like she it. she really did, did like it. Did you know it. she paints? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, she's an artist. 
And but she sings, she can dance, she can do everything. She can sing like too. You. Yeah. And that, that is the beautiful rose, mm -hmm. tropical rose. But see what I mean about the uh, variegated foliage? Yeah, you can see and it there. The more sun you get, the brighter the leaf is. See how okay. bright that leaf is? Mm -hmm. It backlights everything. And I mix these together because it, it is like sprinkling stars throughout your flower beds. <laughs> I love it. Be, whether it is a hanging plant or whether you're going to put it in a container or several containers. Yes. I mean, you get two each of three different colors. Precisely. And there's the golden okay, creeping jenny in the front. And I'm offering that today too. Wouldn't you rather see that than mulch? And look how it mm -hmm. lights up everything else. I've got a really limited quantity of that. It's perennial. It comes back every single year. We're going to do a little planting demo and I'll show you how to do it okay. with the creeping jenny. How about that? Now, Philip, I'm going to um, oh. take this for a second because, yeah. you know, this is generally what an impatience looks like. And, you know, even the flats that you get at the big box store, they aren't sun patients most likely. And they're just teeny tiny and you pull them out and they really don't do a heck of a lot, particularly through the summer. They kind of go like, ah. And we're not doing dinky here. This is this is the how you plant it. Okay. You've got your nice soil and your very lightweight whiskey barrel. By the way, these are quite limited too. Don't miss out on the whiskey barrels. Make sure you've got your pots before your plants come. These ship straight away. <laughs> now I've got my lightweight soil in okay. there. Look at this. I put that in there like that. Mm -hmm. Then I smooth it in like that. We're okay. not through. Pay okay. attention. There's not a lot to do, but this is my beautiful fertilizer, my time release fertilizer. Look at this. No mixing, no dirty hands. If you've ever fed chickens before, you'll know how to fertilize. <laughs> this is all you do. Look at this. That's it. And on top. And on, and on top now. That's it. Now, how I, often do I do that? Hold on a minute. Okay. Now I'm going to water it <laughs> in. So you got to water in your plants as soon okay. as you plant them. So I've okay. done that. Now that's going to get going. Okay. Now. If I wanted to do, I'm just going to sneak this in oh, on you. Our this creeping, is a golden Jenny. creeping Jenny. This is one of the six plants okay. that comes in that. I just plant oh, okay. that in the edge. This okay. will cascade all the way over the edge. This comes back every year. Oh, so and pretty. when your auto delivery of sun mm -hmm. patients comes next year because mm -hmm. you locked it in. Mm -hmm. And then you already have your creeping Jenny. Yes, and then you just plug the sun patients in. The, okay. That will be there. So Ooh, there, that's why we need auto the delivery. Okay. The middle of the summer, okay, this wait. is the size. Wait, wait. What? Let me go back because I'm going to ask you again. How many times should I fertilize? I'm trying to tell you now. Okay. <laughs> now, look, this is what I did. I planted this, I uh -huh. fertilized it, and I watered it mid-season. Okay. Then this is what it looks like. That's when I fertilize it again. The middle Mid of the summer. But not every month, not every week. You listen carefully. Uh -huh. The middle of the summer. <laughs> this is when I do the second one. Okay. And I water it and I fertilize it. Now, here we are, Labor Day. Look how big this is. That's when I fertilize it the third Your time. time. <laughs> and that's it. Okay. In, in container planting, any kind of annuals that you have, you de do need to fertilize them more often than things in the ground because as you water, it leaches the nutrients out the drain that. holes. And there are five uh -huh. drain holes in the bottom of each of these containers, so it drains quite nicely, but they do need to be fed a little more often. So you got this is the beginning. This is the middle of the summer, mm -hmm. and this is Labor Day. This is one plant. How long will it last? Until frost. Until frost. And when everybody else is planting mm -hmm. those horrible chrysanthemums in the fall, look what <laughs> you have. Isn't this nice? It doesn't look like a pet cemetery. It looks like a party. Could I ask you another question? Please. Okay, because I got the fertilizer thing you now. <laughs> <Go ahead. laughs> All right. I'm, I'm sorry. Um, Jay, say that again. Uh, 32,000 have already been ordered um, just since 9 o'clock, 8,500. Um, size of pot, will that determine the size of the outcome? Kind of, as Ginger pointed out yes. earlier today, it's like the goldfish bowl. That will determine the size of the Perfect goldfish. If you've got it. a small pot, it'll stay small. The bigger the pot, the bigger the plant. Okay. And by the way, my whiskey barrels have been deemed on Facebook the, just the right size. Just the right size. And the cool thing is, I love what you reminded us of. If you're going to put this in a pot, you need the pot. Get the pot before the yes. plant shows up. The plant will show up when it's time to put it in the but ground the in your area. the pots are shipping now. The, the pots will ship and now. And make sure, so when your plants come, you've already got your pots and you're good to go. And I use all of these collections. I mix these together 
in my garden because they look gorgeous. Your garden That's beside is amazing. My no driveway. You're but you see, I've got the chartreuse color like mm -hmm. I have with the creeping Jenny and other plants too because it's the foliage. It's, it's the foliage. And like in our tropical co collection, it's the foliage and the blooms. That's a beautiful purple candy, which is new. You got the hot pink and then you got that ruby star shape.